Dr. Eric Kaplan is a national best-selling author. His books include Dying to be Young and the Lifestyles of the Fit and Famous. Dr. Kaplan served as an advisor to the President's Council on Physical Fitness and Sports and has worked with professional athletes from numerous sport teams, including the New York Yankees, Mets, and Knicks, Minnesota Twins, the Boston Red Sox, and Celtics, as well as PGA and LPGA athletes. He has now utilized his 29 years of chiropractic experience to help develop the Disc Force Spinal Decompression System. How does Disc Force relieve chronic back pain? Chronic back pain is an epidemic that's sweeping America. It's actually the number one cause of disability. It's estimated that over 40 million Americans, one out of three people, suffer chronic neck or back pain. The spine is a uniquely simple yet complex mechanism. What you have is 24 movable segments. In between each one of these vertebrae is a disc, which is made of nucleus pulposus and annulus fibrosus, but let's say fluid to make it simple. And as we're younger, these discs actually have more water content. The more water content, the more flexible. This is why children, they can bend, they can twist, they can fall, never any pain, never any problems. As we age, though, from constant compression, from these vertebrae moving up and down repeatedly, the fluid starts to diminish. As the fluid gets displaced, what happens is we develop areas, what we call herniations. Herniations can then rupture. A rupture then would put a trap, the vertebrae, on top of each other to the nerve. The result? terrible pain. Sometimes you could have pain, back pain, neck pain, pain down your leg, pain down your arm. What we try to do with decompression is actually open up the vertebrae and allow that fluid to seep back in into the disc space, which relieves the pain naturally, gently, effectively, not surgically. Why do you feel that disc force is the superior spinal decompression system? This force has revolutionized the technology that doctors are utilizing in their office. What decompression therapy can do, it's a gentle way of opening up a segment. Years ago, they would put a person maybe in the hospital, they would put traction on them, they would make them hang these weights at the end of the leg, and the nurse might come by every hour, how are you feeling? Now, through technology, through systems, through computers, actually, this force has specific mechanism that can go by vertebrae, by the patient, we can actually target which vertebrae, which specific vertebrae, and by doing that, what you can do is create a gentle, non-invasive approach to pain relief.